Good afternoon guys, AJ here with Outfish Dangling and today's episode is all about catching big catfish. I'm going to show you guys my setup that will guarantee you to get into some catfish whether it's your grandma, grandma, mom or dad or your children. This is one of the funnest ways to get into big fish with your family and have a great time. And without further ado, let's get into our setup and get you started. Alright guys, let's talk about some important things before we talk about gear and all that. And that is the time of the day, the seasons, and the rest of the stuff that goes into preparing you to get into the best number of catfish. So generally, in winter, catfish will be a lot more lethargic, not as willing to eat aggressively. So you've got to weigh that out. You can give it a try, but if you want to get into some real numbers, usually after winter early spring is good they're waking up they're hungry so april is really a lights out month if you want to get into a, a consistent amount of fish quality fish as well so that's number one the second thing is as the water temperature rises the catfish will become more aggressive that's super important if you're trying to get into good numbers now times of the day is probably one of the things that i care about the most and that is low light. So in the mornings, you want to be there before first light even. Shortly, stay through that sunrise and post sunrise bite is really, really good. I've had numbers where I'm catching like 10 or 15 in just an hour, an hour and a half time frame. Same thing goes in the afternoon. You start like an hour before it starts getting darker and fish through the sunset and past. I go all the way up until 10, 11, 12 p.m. and have produced some really good numbers. It's whatever your body allows you to, you know, uh, stay out there and fish. So those are really important times. I like to get out, go eat some lunch, some breakfast, come back and do the same thing at night. And as you guys will see in my episode later on, we're going to absolutely slay these fish in low light. So on that note, let's get you over to the gear table and show you what we use, the line, the bait and everything and uh, hopefully prepare you for some really good catfishing. See you guys soon. Well already guys, let's get out to the most important part, which is the gear. That is what you've all been waiting for. It is really simple. And after I show you, you're gonna be able to get out there, get right on the water and hook some big fish and land them without a doubt. So let's get into it. This right here is a eight foot heavy rod that is produced by Bass Pro Shops. It is their King Cat line of rods for catfish, of course, and it comes actually paired up with this reel and 25 pound mono which is more than enough for you guys to get out and catch some fish you can replace it with fluoro but why replace anything when it's ready to go some of the additions that i have made to make it a lot easier to get out there and cast far is i put these one ounce weights i do a couple so i can go as far as i want to and what you guys will see is that i've got a swivel to an actual bead back with the weights another beat to a swivel so i don't have these weights bouncing off my line and cutting it instead the beads will stop it between a swivel so that's about it and i've gone with this pre-rigged 40 pound fluoro line that goes into a seven knot circle hook very important to have that seven knot circle hook but that's all it is it is simply 25 pound mono to a seven knot circle hook 40 pound fluoro two ounce weights beads heavy duty swivels that's the setup and that's all i really have and the best part about this setup is if you've got a small car you just break it down put it away and now you have two rods 39.99 plus the weights probably another four dollars let's say throw in some beads for another four dollars the hooks are about uh, $3.99 and you get two. 
and that's all it takes to get on that setup. So without a further ado, let's get into some footage. What you're going to see is me meeting up with Paul in the morning to get on some quality cats with him and his son and Greg. And then you're gonna see us go away, come back at night and fish with some other buddies for an evening bite. There's going to be so many catfish in this episode, you guys. I hope you enjoy it. See you underwater and let's get into some. Good morning, guys. This is the morning portion of fishing for catfish before the sunrise. It is how many degrees out? 28 with a breeze. 28 with a breeze, and I forgot my jacket, my wallet, my pants, my shoes. I roll a lot of bed and just got in the car. Don't ever do that. It's cold. But we're going to get on him. Greg is already at a 29 incher. What a man. See you guys soon. Let's get on him, Paul. Let's get him, buddy. I like to keep a tight tension now, Greg and, and uh, Paul like to leave some loose line, but I like to make sure that that's a hit so I can get it. That's why I outfish these guys any day. I'm kidding. It's like ice fishing this morning for me, dude. It is. <sighs> you have thick waders. I have a condom on. <laughs> Paul didn't think it was gonna be cold, so he wore his see-through jeans. They might as well be see-through jeans, you said, right? They're thin. Yeah, in the summertime, I got my Daisy Dukes that I'm gonna wear with these waders. Yeah, with these. You know how those sexy girls are? Yeah, yeah. Those chaps. I'm gonna be a sexy guy. There you go. And I'm gonna put the camera right here. Camera right here. So when he casts and when he gets a bite, it bounces. Uh. <coughs> oh, there you go. Oh, get it. Holy, it's gone. Holy oh, crap. I almost lost my rod. <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> oh, he's a tiny one. He's already coming off. All right, dude. I'm on. Paul's gonna net for me. Oh, this is the smallest catfish I've caught here, I think. Wait, Jayden's stop missing. reeling. I can't see it. There he is. Yeah, like Jaden's. Either yeah. size, guys. They do. Yeah, we'll get through. <sighs> All right, guys, yeah, just a, a little one. What would you guys say, 24? 23, 24. 23, 24. Let's let him go. Well, that's a hell of a start. First one off the board. Not actually, Greg caught a 29, but let's get back out of there. What time are we doing until 11, you said? 10. Yeah, I got good. About 10 or so, I got to go. Something's happening here. Yep, yep, leave it. Oh, that's a big, giant head, dude. Oh, you got both of your rods. My big giant head just got hit. So, didn't didn't take my rod in, so but they got hit. Fish, that's a big head, <laughs> yeah, he's there again. So it's playing with it. So whatever he's got going on there. I, I let out a bunch of loose lines so I could run with it. See, that that head was too big, and this eight hot hook wasn't working good. So I cut the head down the middle. Now you can see that hook. Got a big one, guys. That is a 29 inch fish, guys. What do you use your guess on the weight? Uh, 
red at nine. If you can see it. Cool. All right. Let this beauty go. What a thick 28, nine year old. 28 and a half inches. All right, let's. There's so many pokey things on the shit they eat though. Yes, sir. Get it, get it. Oh, wow. I don't know how he lost that. Oh, he just had a fish on, as you guys heard. How the hell did he get off? Oh, oh got a fish on. Got a fish on. Got a fish on. Got a fish on. Fish on. Oh, yeah. Right as I turn my. I got a fish on, gentlemen. I forgot where I put the net. Uh, right here. Oh, he's gonna get in. I'm gonna need your help, Paul. Yeah, I can grab the net. Oh, this is a good one, boy. Paul helped me with that one, dudes. And here is mine. Let's see how big it is. I've got me a 30, 30, 30 almost 36. They're almost 36 inch cat. Uh, what a beauty, big head, Paul. Get a good close up shot of that head, buddy. Oh, oh man, these are massive cats, guys. Fish on! Oh! Fish on! Alright guys, I was gonna stop it with fish on. Oh, I got him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Greg, leave that for a minute. Come on down. There's this one, dude. Alright. Yeah. Maybe bring it in the water here if you want, but I'm gonna come back up there, Gary. Oh, oh he's gonna be good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, say something to us. Look Whoa. at us. Dude, he's too big. Talk to us. Look <laughs> at us. Huh? Huh? What are you saying? I said it's too freaking big, this one. Guys, this we went... fighting harder than that 22 pounder. Paul, we went from nothing look to this. Look at this. Paul, we went from nothing to this, huh? Yeah, double. Double up, guys. You got a 35? This has got to be a, at least 35. Oh, my God. Did he look like 20? Oh. I think it's a 20. Just go for him, go for him if you see him. Oh my god! Oh, he's got oh a god. massive one. I can see that. Oh my god, that's bigger than my 22. I got a monster, guys. Oh, way. 25. 25. 25. 25. Yep, just going over 25 pounds. Exactly 39. Beautiful work, Paul. Exactly 39. Yeah. What an epic morning, you guys. We've caught multiple 30s, everywhere between 15 to 20 pounds. I'm gonna continue for about another hour and see if we can get more. But what a morning. Oh, I 
you it. My belt. Oh yeah, they did it though. Just want to give you guys a big tip. I had done everything right with that. You don't set the hook on those circle hooks. You gently bring it tie your line and bring it in. But cross the top. What's happening, guys? I want to give you a little quick midday update. We wanted to fish the low light, except this morning it was so cold. It was probably low 20s and we're freezing. So the catfish had to adjust until the heat came around which is still not here but then it picked up probably between eight and nine in the morning so uh we've caught uh had over five catfish uh three over 30 and a few under 30 but that's okay so on that note we're gonna fish for another hour I'm gonna go ahead and have lunch and then come back this afternoon and kind of do similar uh late in the day before nightfall uh, and it should pick up so i think we're all having a lot of fun aren't we yeah. Sir. So we're gonna continue and what were you gonna say? Got my PB. You got his PB. <laughs> I actually got my PB too. My PB was a 36, his PB is a 39. And uh we're working to get more. See you guys later. Perfect. Dude, that's perfect. Uh, this one, I'm probably just gonna put it Oh, back. that's already in a rod holder? That one, the other one is in a rod yeah, holder. Yeah, I was just gonna get that in the shot too. That's all. Oh, we're on a, oh, is that a, oh, nice. Is that a bird? Is that really a cat right away? Yeah. Holy Want me to pull out? No, but I will need your help netting. You filming? Yeah, guys. Nice. Come Dude. on. Instant. Fish on. Instant. Instant, told ya. Sick. Is he big? He's nice, bro. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's in there. Yeah. Good start, bro. Couple minutes in. Thank you very much. Yeah, that was quick, you guys. Let's measure it for length and weight. 27? 27 inches, guys. 27 inches. Uh, I need this out. It is a 27 inch, 27 inch catfish. All right, guys, just about a seven pound cat. Let's let it go. Beautiful, healthy. We didn't keep it out too long. Now we wait for another one. Let's go. This is like the least like 420-ish, 420 ever. Oh, oh, there oh. you go, there you go. Was that a hit? 110%. Is there a fish on there? No. They're here. All right, guys, and so I've gotten a couple of hits on my rods there. I haven't really checked, but I'm gonna recast a little bit closer now that the sun is behind the clouds. That really has brought him in closer in the past, so I'm gonna try that. Oh, oh, oh there it is. Never mind. Yep. Oh, that's a good one, bud. I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna need your help. Yes, sir. Oh, man, it's pulling. Wow. All right, guys. Ooh, Chris might have to go around the damn cattails. Oh, this is a good one, bud. Feels like a good one. I won't know until you confirm. I like how it's hard bottom right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's about the same as the last. It's just spicy. Well, the shad was definitely on there, huh? Okay. Oh. Here, I'm gonna stop. There you go. All right. Uh, All right, guys, we're gonna do a measurement okay. as usual. It's the little ones that'll get you. Another 27 cutter. incher, guys. Cookie cutter came back. All right, guys, another cookie cutter. I can't believe I'm saying a cookie cutter. Yep. 27 incher. Chris is gonna weigh it. So this is probably a little heavier. Feels a little heavier. And the eight pounder, we're gonna let it go. Because you don't 
Did I go over you? Nope, you're good. Can me and Chris keep catching? Oh, sorry, but yeah, we're just gonna wait now and hopefully for the best bite. Something oh, you, is. You, you, you just got that, I think. Which one? This, this one? one? I think it did. Look, it's off to the side. You think it was a hit? It's like, yeah, oh, yeah, it's, it's yours, it. by the way. Don't set it yet. Let it take it. Literally it. ran off to the side. Has it? Yeah. Just remember the drag has to be a little tighter if you're gonna set the hook. Yeah, yeah, set the drag, 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 bud. Is it on there still? Yep. All right, you're gonna have to probably, unless you bring it right here. Cool, Chris is on top, yep. baby. Come, come in closer. Oh yeah. And let it run if it has to, you know the drill. I'll get in front of you right here, bud. Yeah, right there, Those there you go. Decent? Decent. Oh my God, if you got a 30, I'm gonna squeal. He crunched it, he took off with that sh He's right here. Yeah, bro, let him run. Do not force him. Ooh, ooh. I don't see so him. He's under the reeds. Oh, yeah, here, raise him a bit. Raise him a bit. Nice. All right, boy. Chris is on, boy. Woo. Yeah, brother. Yeah. What do you think? Another 27. Master? Um, 29. Pretty close. Yes. Seven. Seven. A little over seven. Seven, seven. 29 inch run on, AJ. Heck yeah, guys, that's three for tonight, and uh, Chris is going to recast it again. Um, see if we can get another bite. Right there? Yes, yeah, sir. Oh, yes. Oh, Money. Chris, that's that's all I asked for. Money. Boom, and look at that. We're right in the crack. All right, guys. Facts of life are that these nasty ass guts, huh, Chris? Yeah, those livers. I'm tossing this out. She's either dumb or doesn't really follow. She's like, are you gonna be doing take the kid fishing the donkeys? Oh, 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 on again. On again, on again. On again. Chris is on again. So I'll help you with this. Master. Yes. Yep, he is. Look, yeah. you don't even have oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. screw that back, bro. You're not even so epic. <laughs> Alright, so we got 30 incher. 11. Alright, buddy. Yeah. 11 pounds, right on, man. Yeah, that's a fat head on her. It's a big fat fish. Just go back, make some babies. There you go. Alright guys, Chris is on a catfish. I'm gonna take the camera off and take you to him. <laughs> this is the... Dude, a little bit of everything I want. All it's right. okay, screw that raw dude, it's fine. Here right. you go buddy. Here you go, I wanna get you net net. On your bed caster, huh? Yeah. Alright guys. Big fat male dude, that thing is huge. That mouth. Look at that, big fucker. <laughs> nice work. Yes, dude. I think that's the second master angler. Yeah. Dude. Let's see the fish, buddy. That's a big head on there. Oh, guys, that's definitely a male with that huge, huge, yeah. huge head. Let's yeah. see it. Yeah. All right. Look at the size of this guy's head. 
And Chris has a big, big hand, guys. Big male. You can see the blue colors in them. That's a heavy fish, bro. How many pounds do you think it is, Chris? We're gonna find I'm, out. I guess it's 16. All right, let's find out. Zero. Hopefully she he cooperates. Cheers. What does it say? 16.75. pounds, guys. We're gonna let it go. Absolutely beautiful male channel catfish going back to his home. I don't think it's a uh oh oh yeah get it AJ get it that's yeah. what that was yeah it's off it's, it's, on? it's on nice bro oh it wasn't a rodent oh shit it's going for a run i don't know if it's big but somebody uh you can move that reel that in if you want to slowly chris you may have to get this for me he's going to the cattails chris take it Chris, take it. And it's a good one too, Chris. I'm gonna bring it, I'm gonna bring it back to you. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah. All right. Here you go, here you go. All right, guys. Oh, it's too. Real, real, real. Small one? No, I, I haven't seen them, but you're watching. Oh yeah, smaller. He crunched it. Small one? That's not a small one. Oh, that's one. a master. That's definitely not a small one. Yeah. Wow. Huh. Maybe 30 barely. 29, I'll pull it out a little more. 29, I think you'll touch. Oh, no, yeah, there you go. 30. 30. 30. Yeah, 30. Hang on. Alrighty, guys, we got another beauty. We're gonna get her nice and wet real quick. Slap a belly. Nice fat mama. Nice fat mama. Reel down on them. Had them for a second. Definitely saw the fold. Alrighty, it's me. All right. There was no doubt that that last fish I had was a hit. No. Oh. Oh, that oh. One. oh, that one. You're on. Oh, wow, did I just get hosed? No, huh? oh, good God, no. Oh, he's pulling better. I don't know. Oh, damn. Oh, yeah, he got a tank. Oh yeah, you got a thing. Oh man, this may be a turtle, guys. I ain't gonna lie. No turtle. way. Nah, that's a, there's, ain't no turtle swimming that fast. That'd be a fuck. <laughs> 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 turtle in the water. Okay, you're right, Dad. <laughs> what am I talking about? <laughs> if that's a turtle, I'm fucking out of here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, want, I asked for freaking sharks with freaking laser beams on their freaking head. Maybe I'm over exaggerating this fish. It doesn't feel heavy. Oh, this one was uh no not oh I thought he got off. Oh yeah, guys, we're another. Is he over 30? Oh, he looks pretty close. He's right here too. Got him. Oh yeah, he's way bigger. Oh. Yes. Bro. Yeah, that's a fatty. Oh, it's a tank, agent. <laughs> yeah. A tank. It's a tank. What do you think? The, how many was your oh, guess? It's a, it's a beast, bro. That, that's over wow. 20 pounds all day. That's a fat female, that's huh? All, that's over 20 pounds all day. Dude, that's a f***ing tank. Guys, here yes. it is. Big old male. Yes. Oh. Oh. Look at that belly. <laughs> oh, oh God! Dude. All right, where's our measuring tape? Steven, what'd you say? Thirty. I said thirty-four and a half. Let's uh, just gonna afford a little bit, right there. Thirty-three. Almost thirty-four. Yeah, thirty-three and three quarters. Right, you... Zero it out the net. <laughs> Almost nineteen pounds. 
Yeah, it's like 19 pounds. Woo, 18 pounder. Nice shit. 18.9. 18.9. Oh, it's hard. It oh yeah, oh yeah. You're gonna love that one. Yeah, 19 pound catfish right there. I need to hit the gym like Steven. All right, tell me, ready to go? Yeah, you guys ready? Big, big boy. Yeah. All right, guys, a little update. It's getting a little chilly, so I'm putting on a coat. We're going to fish for another couple of hours before we end this episode. Um, well, let's see if we can get a few more. It's going to be a long episode, I'm thinking, with a lot of catches, so yeah. What's up? You decent? Bring him in. All right, guys. Chris is on. Is it a good one? I'm going. So it went over my rods just fine. Yeah. Hell yeah. So you might get yours. I think I'm good. I think I'm clear on all all fronts. Thirty. Master? I don't know, I think so, but decent. Decent fish. Let's see. Yes, Woo. sir. Good work, Chris. Heck yeah. Good call on the bait location change. Yeah, this one has another line in it. Damn. Braid line in it. I don't think That's it's. That's how one. we rescue our catfish guys from braid. Ah, get a little dip. Smallest one we've caught out of here. Oh. <laughs> there she goes. Hey Chris, come back this way too once you get it. Can you reel this one up, AJ? Which one? This one that you're standing next to, tighten the drag and reel it in. It looks like you might be clawed in it, but maybe not. Down here. Okay. Good fish. Just come back this way, Chris. Yeah, walk back this way. I got the waders on here. Got it. It's not too late. Okay, okay. Get it over. You guys got it. You guys got it. Let me see here. So, the big fish. So, what do I want? Just reel, AJ. Yeah, just reel. I mean, I wouldn't worry about it, honestly. Just line that fish. Well, you can't, huh? Oh, uh, there you go. Got him. Got him. All right, guys. Play it through like you did. I just want to see that get landed. Just come back to me. Tank. 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 Tank, bro. Dude. Tank. Yes. Oh, my God. Tank. Tank. This is 20. Yeah. Probably close to 20 pounds. Yeah, definitely close. Dude. 34 and a half inch right there. Oh God, he's pushing 20 all day. 18.38. Poor Chris. One last look, was that 18 and 18.4 pounds? Yeah. yeah. There you go, ready? Bam. Good stuff, bro. Well already guys, we're gonna conclude it with the episode right here. We caught so many fish. I've had the pleasure to come out with Paul in the morning, catch a whole ton of fish, catch his PB cat. I caught my PB cat in the morning and in the afternoon. I was able to fish with Mike, Chris, my mama. Chris, come on in the shot down what here, up? bro. What up, guys? Yeah. Epic night. Epic night, man. We caught multiple, multiple fish. And on that note, we're going to end it. I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as we did. It was epic, really easy. Just get some shad. Take your kids, your wife, your grandma, grandpa, anybody, literally, and your dog. And you'll get on some catfish. Guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, take it easy.